Hello, our mathematicians. Mrs. Dorn and Ava are here to do another awesome math lesson with you. So we're gonna get warmed up. And today what we're gonna do is we're gonna count backwards. We're gonna count backwards. So we gotta think about that. So backwards from 10, are you ready? Here we go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, two, one, zero. How'd you do? I love seeing that mouth moving too. So keep those cameras on. All right, let's do another one. Let's count up, but let's start with another number. I wonder what, what number should we start with? Okay, let's start with seven. So get to thinking in your head what comes after seven. Do you have it? Here we go. Seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. How did you do? Yay, awesome. All right, let's do one more, okay? We've been practicing this a lot. I think they've gotten, I think everyone knows this now, but let's go ahead and practice. Let's count by tens to 100. Are you ready? 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. Great job. Oh my goodness, Ava. She loves using these whiteboards lately. So boys and girls, I want you to make sure you have your whiteboard and a marker because we're gonna do things a little bit different today, actually. We're gonna be talking about shapes, shapes. So I'm wondering if you could draw a shape because Ava loves to draw and she, and she's seen some of your artwork and knows that you are an amazing, you are an amazing artist too. So what I would like everyone to do right now, including you Ava, is I would like you to draw a circle. And as soon as you're done drawing a circle, show us. Ready? Go. Okay. Draw that circle. And as soon as you're done, show us. Oh, did you do your circle? Awesome work, very nice job. All right, erase your board, let's do another. Let's do another, okay, okay. You ready? Everybody, draw a triangle. Can you draw a triangle? Show me. Triangle, what does a triangle look like? That's kind of a hard one. Okay, show me, show me, show me. Very nice job, I love it triangle. Good work. And boys and girls, you know what? It is fun to draw and it is also fun to make pictures. So I'm going to show you a thing that you can do. Um, and then we're going to get started on some shapes too. And I'm going to be popping into a lot of breakout rooms to talk about shapes here in a little bit. But before I do, because I know in your breakout room, you're going to be able to draw some shape pictures, but there's also kind of a cool um, site that you can check out. So if we go into our classroom today, and you go back into our math area here, you're gonna see a box with shapes. Do you see it? Do you see it? It's right over here. It's got a blue, blue shape and a pink shape and a green shape. And boy, we gotta learn a lot of shape names, don't we boys and girls? Let's go ahead and click in. And what you can do, this is kind of a fun thing, is you can make a picture with these shapes, I'm gonna show you how to do it. So you can take your mouse and these are all called polygons. Polygons are any shapes that have straight sides and they're all connected. So see all these, and if you click on them, you can get all these different shapes. But if you don't want them, you just click on that trash can there. I think I clicked on too many. So I'm gonna pick a shape that I wanna start with and maybe, and a circle is not a polygon, is it? Because it has, it has um, no straight sides. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm going to use this shape, which is a square. And by the way, you can change even the color if you click on this circle down here. So you can change that to whatever you want it to be. And the other cool thing is you can even make it bigger. So say I wanted to make this square a little bigger, plus size, plus makes it big. So I'm gonna scooch it over. So now I have a square. And maybe I'm gonna use, I'm gonna use one of these triangles on top of it. And you know what, down here, there are some tools. So you could even do like your own picture. So you can click on that 
and you could, oops, that will get straight lines. But if you wanted to just draw even, you could click on the pen. Oops, I gotta change my color so that you can see it and it shows up. So I could see if you can figure out what I'm drawing a picture of. Can you figure it out? These shapes can draw pictures of things, can't they? And what did I draw? I drew a house. Isn't this fun? You could do all sorts of things with this. So boys and girls, and if you mess up and you're like, oh, I don't, I messed up. I don't know what to do. Calm down, take a belly breath because it's not a big deal. Because look at right down here, you have what's called an eraser. And if you click on that eraser and just go over it, boom, those things can be gone. So that's kind of a fun way to do it. And so what you're going to do today is you are going to be able to take out a piece of paper or your whiteboard. And I want you to draw a picture with shapes. And you can use squares and triangles and circles and rectangles and maybe ovals. You remember what an oval is? Oh my goodness. Well, we're going to get started because I'm going to also be coming into breakout rooms and talking more about shapes with you. So let's get started. <laughs> 